Hey cat cakes, welcome back to another video. So tomorrow is my cheat day. I wanna go full beast mode and eat a lot of things. And I have a lot of foods that I wanna eat that's on my list right now, so. I'll see you guys tomorrow when it is my cheat day. Rise and shine everyone. It's not rise and shine, it's literally 3 p.m. Me and Emily are getting ready to eat our first cheat meal food of the day at like 3 p.m. She has a cheat meal every day. No, I don't. Yes, you do. I have Pilates in the morning and I just didn't have time to eat. So now we're gonna go to Starbucks. Starbucks is our first stop. Emily wants to get like this holiday drink. I'm not really- All of their holiday drinks are out. It's not a holiday drink. The entire menu is out. I just wanna go there to get my favorite holiday drink. Okay, Emily's a little cranky right now because she's hangry. Yeah, because you took like 45 hours to get ready and I had to stay downstairs in this hot freaking jacket. <laughs> Take it off. And you, no, I don't want to. Because I'm wearing this shirt underneath and it's going to get cold again. <laughs> I'm going to eat something. I'm not letting you put this in the video. If you do, I'm literally going to expose you right now. What? All your ugly pictures in the camera roll. Like, I'm not even joking, Evelyn. If you put this in the video, I will slap your face and I'll expose you and I'll send all the ugly pictures to Fred. And no pictures are ugly. Three. Really? Do you want me to pull out the pictures right now? I'll pull them out. Anyways, guys, I have a really, really big sweet tooth and my favorite bakery is like 30 minutes from here, so I'm gonna go the extra mile and drive 30 minutes to get my favorite bakery stuff. I love Emily, just don't show. Exactly. Um, Erica's not here with us today because she's in New York hanging out with her friend, but we're gonna eat all the yummy foods without her, so sucks for her. Ooh, I'm so excited. Like, today is going to be the best day ever. Why do you keep talking? Emily, your they face is care. ugly. Hi, um, could I get a caramel ribbon crunch frappuccino? Uh, grinding caramel ribbon crunch. That'll be all. Thank you. There's a lot of caramel in this, and they don't usually put a lot of caramel. I wanna try. It's very sweet, just warning you. Look at the bottom, it's like all caramel. Mm. Guys, if you want diabetes, get whatever Emily ordered. What was it called again? Caramel Ribbon Crunch. I used to get this all the time. This is my drink, Caramel Macchiato. I love coffee. Mm. Yum. Guys, it smells so good in here. Bag of bakery goods. We'll do a little haul of what we got. <gasps> Ooh. This is our lemon tart, lemon cake, and a brownie. Look how beautiful they look! And then this is an apple Danish butter scone cheesecake. This whole pie was 40 bucks, and we were like really contemplating, but I was like on the spot, so I was like, I'll just get it. Oh, oh my god, this my looks so good. Gosh, this looks that amazing. Looks so good. Eek. I'm so excited. Oh my god. Let's try with the lemon tart first. Three, two, one. Mmm. Mmm. Is this so good? Mm -hmm. mm. It's sweet and sour at the same time. Perfect quantity. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm. This is worth the $56 we spent. Mm -hmm. This whole thing was $56. Mmm. Amazing. I can't have enough. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Should we try this one? Mm -hmm. Alright, now we're gonna try this lemon tart. How do I do this? Should I like... This looks so pretty. I don't want to like ruin it. Or should we just bite out of it? Yeah. Ready? Mmm. -hmm. Mm, that's good. What do you like better? I don't know. This one's more like... Mm. Sauce. This is like more like... I don't know how to explain it. Mmm. What is this? Can I eat this thick skin? Mmm. They're both different. Mm hmm This one doesn't taste that lemony. It's more like custard, I think. Mmm, wow. I'm not a big fan of custard. And there's a classic brownie. I'll just bite out of it. Alright. can't go wrong with that. It's just a brownie. Yeah, it's just a brownie. Next plate. <laughs> we have the scone. It's, it's so favorite. good. Literally, like, I don't like any type of scones. They have to be, like, cooked this way. And it has I don't to be like a scones. butter scone. It's just so... Mmm. Mmm. It's so good. I don't really like it. Mmm. 
So here's what she says. I think it's apple. Thank you. Cheers. Mm. Yeah, this is probably just regular. It's a croissant cheese danish. Can't go wrong. Mm -hmm. mm. My favorite so far is the lemon tart. Same. I wish you guys could taste it. Like, it's so good. And the little crust part is like perfectly crusty. Every flavor is just evenly like. Mm. I'm kind of scared. <gasps> it's so jiggly. Oh my god. Jiggly. Mm. That's good. Mm. Everything is so sweet. Guys, we had too many sweet stuff all at once. Oh, that was a lot of sweet stuff. I literally just want to throw up. <laughs> this is too sweet for me. This, I can't. this got really sweet I so can't fast. go to a bakery without like wanting to throw up. But good thing our next meal is... Something spicy. Spicy. We're going to eat tteokbokki for lunch. I want to eat the tteokbokki right now. I want, don't you want something spicy yeah. now? Yeah. All right. Let's go. Let's go. My next meal, I'm gonna make rose tteokbokki, and it's basically like a creamy tteokbokki, so it's not like as spicy. And I've seen it everywhere on the internet, and I've never tried it before. So I have all these ingredients that I just got from Udi Mart. I hope I make it right, but it's like super easy to make. So okay, I'm gonna basically just stir fry vegetables that I have here. There's sausages and fish cakes, and I have a bowl of rice cakes right here. It smells so good. Mm. Mm. We put this sauce in, so it's like super spicy. It doesn't look that spicy, but it's super spicy. Everything's ready! Guys, we have our rosé tteokbokki here, and it looks so freaking good. It's like super creamy and cheesy. I have this meishu juice. For my juice. Mm. This is the Chinese glass noodle. That's chewy. Mm -hmm. The Chinese glass noodle is super chewy. It's like spicy but at a good level. Mmm. I was looking at my pop socket. Mm. We also got snacks. This is so good. And cheddar cheese Pringles. I can't eat spicy things. I feel like I'm in heaven right now. Mm. And tteokbokki, do you like the oding better or the tteokbokki better? Tteokbokki. Same. I'm gonna eat this in one bite. Mm. I had a dream. You know how I have like really straight teeth? Yeah. I had a dream that my bottom teeth were getting crooked. And it was such a bad dream. Like these like random teeth started forming right here. Really? And it looks so ugly. So what did try. you do? I don't know, I, w I think I woke up. That was such a weird dream. I've been having like weird dreams these days. I think like yesterday. I've been having weird dreams every day. <laughs> she had a dream that the Kardashian sisters were snorting cocaine and then they died. And then me and Erica did it too. And we both died. And then she ended up driving driving a Ferrari like 488, something like that. Yeah, like a. How do you even remember that? How do you even uh, know what kind of during, Ferrari you drive? <laughs> during that time, I was like kind of obsessed with cars. I used to watch the like Keeping Up with the Kardashians. And then, you know, I just had a dream about. Them. She had a dream that uh, she got a toy poodle. <laughs> and it came to life and it started talking. Yeah, it started like acting like a human and then it tried to kill Jerry because it was jealous. <laughs> <laughs> I had another dream that I was in Antarctica and there was like this huge igloo and I was living there and I was like making friends with all the penguins and sharks and stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> but then all of a sudden, sea lions, they tried to like eat me. Like I was swimming in the water and like I was like this tiny. Was that when you were in your like phase where you loved watching those like jab ge geography. Yeah, videos. oh my god, I had a huge phase when I, yeah, it was She just watched phase. she was she was obsessed with lions. I was obsessed with lions. I was obsessed with whales. Oh yeah. Killer whales, sharks. So weird. It would be like 3 a.m. and I could hear her from the, the other The sea room. life. I would literally watch anything related to sea and water stuff and ocean stuff and I would fall asleep to those videos. It was so weird. It's so cool. It like, like I want to go whale blue. watching. Whale watching is so boring. And I also want to go scuba diving 
can like swim around sharks and stuff. I would do that, but I wouldn't go whale watching. That's so boring. Like you just watch on a boat. That's true. Watching whales just jump out of the water. I think whales are so I wouldn't cool. Swim with whales. I'm scared of the sea life. Oh my god, I was watching this whale explode. <laughs> what? <laughs> it was like a 30 second video and like this whale just exploded. I think it had something to do with like the gas in its stomach and the stomach just exploded and it died. Guys, I'm gonna have something healthy. I'm gonna need a clementine. <laughs> Guys, like once it's like about to turn winter, it gets like super depressing. Winter depression. Yeah. Seasonal depression is the worst. Oh my god. And then it gets better right after, right when Christmas hits. And then, it and gets then after worse. that it gets worse. Mm -hmm. And then it starts to get better in like May, April. Right after Christmas is the worst. Oh my god, post Christmas depression is so mm -hmm. bad. Cause like you have nothing to look forward to. Mm -hmm. like, what do you do after Christmas? It's like, yay. It's like, yay, you got all these presents and then it's like, oh. Uh oh, what do I do now? There's New Year's, but New Year's is like just one day. Yeah, I'm getting into a really big food coma now. 15 days until I officially move into my apartment. So two weeks and one day. Tomorrow, it'll be officially two weeks from now. I can't stop eating. What is wrong with me? I want to leave this household. And do what? Oh no, I want to run away. Oh, I just been listening to depressing Adele songs. Adele is not depressing. Adele is just fun. What's your favorite song from Adele? Um, Water Under the Bridge, Easy on Me, and All I Ask. I love other songs, but what got you into Adele? <coughs> I don't know. I've always been to Adele. I went through the stage when you know Hello, mm -hmm. when Hello first came out. I used to listen to that every single day. I like, remember. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I used to listen to Pumbaya and Fire <laughs> from BTS and Hello. Mm. I'm done. Just a Gotta add in some healthy food. One piece of orange is not gonna do justice. Hey guys, this is my last cheat day meal-ish. I have pignon and it's like a bunch of vegetables with like spicy sauce and noodles. It looks like this. Mm, I'm so excited. And I have some samgyeopsal, and it's so good with the noodles. Mm. I also have cooked kimchi here. Mm. I'm eating dinner alone because Emily's not home. Erica's out with her friends, and my parents already ate dinner, so. A sad dinner date with me and you. I literally just spent my whole day just eating. I just hate how I get full so easily. Like I wanna eat so much, but I get full so fast and I can't eat everything. So it's like, it's so annoying. But then I get hungry really easily. Like I get full really fast and then I get hungry really quickly. Life is just hard. It's just complicated. This pork and noodle combination is like so good. It's just so addicting and you just keep eating it. Mm. If someone asked me what my favorite food is, I would say it's either tteokbokki, sushi, I don't know, it all depends on my mood. My all-time favorite would be sushi, actually. No, I really like tteokbokki, but I also like cake. You know that feeling when you're so full, but you keep eating because it's so good? Last bite. Mm. Good morning. I'm in food coma. Hey guys, I forgot to record. Basically, I was drinking this chocolate almond milk and it's unsweetened, but it's chocolate, so it's really good. So I was drinking this and I got myself my favorite ice cream, the screw bar. This is strawberry and peach flavored and it's my favorite Korean ice cream. Mm. So freaking good. Mm. I used to eat this literally every day when I was younger and it's my favorite ice cream ever. You can never get sick of it. Mm. Anyways, I had so much fun filming this video because I was just eating the entire day and eating whatever I wanted. Comment and like if you guys liked it and enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next video.